Hello Taurus, how are you guys doing? Welcome back. Hope you guys are doing well. Everyone enjoyed their Christmas. Um, thank you for tuning in guys. <laughs> so you already know this is going to be a general reading. Take what you can, leave uh, the rest, okay? If you are connected to a Taurus and you're cross watching this, keep in mind the reading can be completely reversed at any given point here. Just so just make sure that you switch it the way that you need to, okay? Taurus, please, 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 my loves, hit the like button for me, please. It really does help to get these videos out there, okay? So, yes, this is for Taurus, Moon, Rising, Venus as well. So let's see what's coming towards the Taurus in love. What is coming towards Taurus? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus in love. Taurus. What is coming towards Taurus? Taurus. Taurus. Full game. <laughs> All right. So, Taurus, you have promise. This relationship shows a lot of potential if you are willing to put in the work. So, um, who pulled this? Aquarius. Aries, you may be dealing with any of those signs. You can have any of those signs in your chart, Taurus, okay? Um, let me get one more card for the Taurus. In love, Taurus. Taurus, in love. What else do we need to see? Oh, okay. Spirit has spoken, guys. The one, <laughs> the one you have been looking for. This part may be the one you have been looking for, so give it a fair chance. So you may definitely be dealing with an Aquarius because Aquarius did pull these two, okay? And also Aries, I believe. But Taurus, oh, and Leo, you got secrets. There are hidden feelings or undisclosed intentions in this relationship, okay? So let's see what the freak that that's about. What is coming towards Taurus? And, uh, you may be dealing with another Taurus. What is coming towards Taurus in love, angels? What is coming towards Taurus in love, Taurus? The world. Ooh. A, re a new relationship is on the horizon for you, Taurus. The world is about, you know, it's either you're ending a chapter or you're beginning a new chapter. So some of you are ending karmic relationships. Maybe this person is karmic situations. And now you're, you know, you're wanting to start a new chapter in your life. You're starting something new here, possibly with a fixed sign. Aquarius, Taurus, Scorpio, Leo. But you got the sun. This new chapter is going to make you very happy. Okay. What is coming towards Taurus and love angels? What else? You got the Magician, Five of Cups reverse, Taurus. What's coming towards Taurus in love, please? You may be dealing with a Virgo, a Gemini. What's coming towards Taurus in love? Can I have one more card? Taurus. What is coming towards Taurus in love? Oh, all right. So, Taurus. Exactly. I feel like whoever the hell this person is, they're they're taking you by surprise here, Taurus. Okay, um, they make you so happy. It's almost like some of you are gonna get that feeling of damn, this motherfucker is too. <laughs> they're just too good to be true. I mean, the magician is intimidating because it, it it can be our ideal partner, our ideal match. I mean, so it's almost like this person. This person is kind of perfect in your eyes. Obviously, no one's perfect, but. This person is perfect in your eyes or this person feels like you're perfect in their eyes. Okay. You can do no wrong here, Taurus. Um, yeah. So someone's fully prepared here. They've got the cup for the love, the emotional capacity, Taurus. They've got the passion, the wand. <laughs> you know, they got the passion, the wand, the drive to pursue this connection they are probably very stable, successful, or someone who, you know, they, they're very reliable, okay, trustworthy. And then you also got the sword for the intellect and the communication. This is a Mercury card, Taurus. Okay, 
So with that being said, someone's ready to abracadabra you, Taurus. That's what I'm hearing. Okay, that's what they want to do. Abracadabra. Boom. Your boo is here. <laughs> um, I think some of you are really getting the willpower here to overcome some kind of disappointment in your past. Okay. Some of you, um, someone was faced with a lot of problems from their past, um, past relationships, regrets, poor, poor choices. Um, but I just kind of feel like someone's finally ready to turn around here, Taurus. They're ready to, to turn around and to take advantage of this connection and to, uh, you know, it's almost like someone's like, you know what? I got my groove back. I'm ready. I'm ready for this. Okay. I'm ready for you, Taurus. I'm ready for this. Um, they're ready to put a smile on your face. I'm hearing that this is someone who just wants to show you love. They want to make you happy. Obviously, you can't make someone happy, but they want to bring happiness and sunshine into your life. Um, this person is definitely going to be a breath of fresh air for you, Taurus. Okay. They may have children. Okay. This may be a heady man or some sort. Somebody who um, maybe for work, they work with tools. Maybe a mechanic or something for some of you. Uh, maintenance. Something like that. But there's a new chapter starting, Taurus. Okay. Uh, usually when the world comes up, it usually talks about a new relationship that's on the horizon for you. Okay. A new chapter of your life is about to start. A lot of you... You're letting go of whatever this was. You got two fives. Okay, this is conflict. Whatever this was that was keeping you stuck from moving forward in a positive uh, direction with love, you're releasing that. If it was fear, if it was, I don't know, abandonment issues, whatever this was, you're releasing that. If it was an ex or pain from the past, you're releasing that. Or the person you're dealing with, they're releasing that. Okay, they're no longer crying over spilled milk, operating from a place of ego, operating from a place of, I gotta hurt you before you hurt me. Um, you know, you're you're no. There's no more of that, Taurus. Now all they want to do is make you happy here. Okay, it's what they want. You may be dealing with someone who lives at a distance, Taurus. Okay, but you got the King of Pentacles, so this is someone who you know. Could be another Taurus, but this is somebody who definitely is a stable, concrete individual here, Taurus. Um, you can rely on them. You can build with them. You can trust them. They are very loyal. Um, yeah, Taurus. So, I mean, what else? What are you waiting for? I feel like there's a lot of fear here with the moon. You may be dealing with a Pisces. Maybe you have Pisces moon. Or this person does. But there's a lot of fear um, when it comes to this person's intentions uh you know what the hell they want here but all this person wants to do is make is make you happy they just want to bring you happiness that's just what i'm hearing okay so it's time to stop fighting this because that's what someone's been doing here they've been fighting this connection uh their guard has been all the way up taurus Okay, um, they just they just want you to let them love you. Um, they want you to get out of your head. So a lot of you, you're getting out of your head or someone's getting out of their head here. I feel like someone, you know, they struggle with trust issues. They're overthinking. And a lot of it uh, has to do with the past. Could be an Aquarius, but you are releasing baggage. Someone's releasing baggage here. And they're ready to embark on a new uh, journey, a new, you know relationship here so it's saying that they may be the one Taurus so you know don't don't be quick to um you know shoot this person away a lot of you are bound stuck someone's bound stuck they've been bound stuck in negativity maybe uh, a karmic relationship was holding them back okay or maybe this whatever this unhealthy pattern mindset whatever it is negativity it was holding the, the freak back, Taurus, okay? <laughs> All right? It was holding them back. But I feel like someone just, they, they're letting it go. They're letting it go. That's just the truth. Four coins reverse. They're letting go of this emotional unavailability. That's what the world is about, letting go. And now they're ready to, you know, embrace this new, you know, beginning here. I feel like somebody was probably inconsistent or not putting in a lot of work because they just, someone was in that mindset of, okay, put in the work, end up getting hurt, 
you know, it's just, it all stems from trust issues, okay? And emotional and um, unavailability. That's all it was. So if you were dealing with someone who wasn't really putting forth effort or something like that, that's why. It had more to do with them than you, Taurus. Okay. So we know that this person is the one you've been looking for, and they just want to put a smile on your face. And they will. They will. I do want to clarify the magician for Taurus in love. What is the magician for Taurus? But it's kind of saying the relationship or this connection will, is what you make of it. If you want it to be a success, you got to put in the work. You got to be consistent here. You got to get out of your fears. Get out of your head. You got to just, okay, that is what it, it is saying, Taurus. You got a whole lot of twos here, Taurus. A whole lot of twos. So you may be seeing two, two, two a lot, okay? Some of you have a choice. Stay in this state of denial of this love or take it, you know? Take it or leave it. So basically, the universe is telling you, take it or leave it, okay? Take it or leave it, Taurus. What is the five of swords in first? Somebody was probably hurt here. Someone pushed the other away because they were hurt. So they pushed someone else away who was maybe just, you know. I feel like this person was probably even innocent, Taurus. Okay. Somebody wants to do the right thing here. Somebody wants to do the right thing. Um, whoever fucked up, I feel like somebody may try to... Uh, Give some kind of apology as well with the page of cups here at Taurus. They will. They know they were wrong. Someone didn't treat you right, Taurus. Um, or they treated you unfairly. Okay. Um, some of you, I'm also hearing the decision could be that maybe you're in a karmic situation. Or your person's in a karmic situation. Um, they're like, should I go back to this? And try to fix it, work on it. Will it be different this time? No, it won't, Taurus. Okay. It's not going to be different this time. It just won't. Okay, so it's time to release that other idiot. <sighs> All right, so let's go ahead, Taurus, and see what this person wants to tell you. Okay. Someone is seeing the, the glass is half full now, they're feeling more positive more optimistic in love and I'm ready for this I'm ready for you Taurus all right what does this person want to tell the Taurus what does this person want to tell the Taurus yep someone's overthinking here Taurus what else Taurus somebody really cares about you they just they just they just want you to let their love uh adorn adorn you Okay, let my love adorn you. What else for the Taurus? What else for the Taurus? What else for the Taurus? Yeah, I feel like Taurus, you you definitely have somebody who's very stable. Um, and they, they're in a place to where they're they want to take care of you. Okay. I'm hearing someone about like they want to spoil you or some crap like that. Okay. Losing you is not an option, Taurus. That's that's not an option in their book, okay? I want to take care of you. I'm obsessed with you. I mean, you do have them obsessed. I'm afraid of losing you. I care about you so much. Please don't give up on me. I'm overthinking. Someone's like, man, your love is just too good to be true. Your love is too strong. Your love is too much. You know, the sun is a very bright car. The sun, the rays are strong. You can't even look at the sun without covering your eyes you know so it could be very strong these are strong feelings here i'm planning a surprise and wait for me so the surprise could be that this person is going to let you know if this is a third party situation they're going to tell you i'm listen i've let my karmic go it's done i'm ready to start something new with you others of you the surprise is taking advantage of this connection making you happy um you know pretty much getting over themselves that way they can make this connection with you a success Taurus that is what they want okay so I hope you enjoyed this reading okay thank you so much remember to like the video also Taurus if you're still watching comment down below where the freak my Taurians are from I love you guys so much um this Aquarius love you guys so let me know where the freak you guys are from okay thank you see you guys next time